Hi, this is Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse and welcome to another two minute tip. Today we're going to show you how to do an IMU calibration. What is an IMU calibration? Well, the IMU is the inertial measurement unit. That's kind of the brain inside the copter that tells that it's level and that everything's working properly. Anytime we do a firmware update, we're going to do an IMU calibration. Right out of the box, you're going to do an IMU calibration. And if you're out in the field and you start it up and it tells you you need to do one, well, then you're going to need to do one. Now, doing it is actually fairly simple. We're going to go to the little quadcopter icon there. We're going to go to sensors and we're going to select IMU calibration. Now, an important point here is this mod value for the compass. We want to get that as low as possible, generally around 1200 to 1400, and then we're going to go ahead and start the IMU. If that number is too high, you're going to need to move the copter somewhere or make sure there's no metal or electronics around to make sure that it's not going to interfere. So we're just going to go ahead and start it. It's going to give us a progress bar telling us that it's going, and now it's going to take about 10 minutes to go ahead and complete this calibration. And now that our calibration is showing 100%, we're now good to fly. We can go back to our main menu and we have safe to fly. Now, after we do that IMU calibration, we want to go back outside to wherever we're going to fly and redo the compass calibration. So watch the other two minute tip on how to do a compass calibration. This has been Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse. We'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.